The Adventures of Slim Goodbody in Nutra City. Slim Goodbody, brave and true, a man of health, a hero who leads a team at body control. Nutrition's his mission, good health's his goal. When we left Body Control, Chief Hardy and B-1 were preparing to go on an emergency call to stop the gobbler and stuffin' from stealing children's nutritious food. Let's listen. And remember, Lois and Ricky, while the Chief and I are gone, don't let any strangers into Body Control, no matter what. Understand? Don't worry, B-1. We'll take good care of everything, won't we, Lois? Oh, we surely will, Ricky. B-1, the Nutricopter is warmed up. Are you ready? Check, Chief. All systems are go. Then let's get started. Uh, Lois and Ricky, I'm leaving you in charge of body control while we're gone. And remember, no strangers. Let's go, B-1. Don't worry about us. Have a good trip. Goodbye. Adios, amigos. Well, with all the excitement, I missed my exercise this morning. How about a little setting up music, Ricky? That's right, Lois. It's important to get our exercise every day. Exercise music coming up. Now it's time to exercise. Everybody's got to exercise. Mo What's that? It's the neutral alarm. That means there's someone at the neutral port. Let's see who it is. OK, activate the neutral viewer. Neutral viewer activated. Who's there? Yeah, hello there. I'm your friendly uh, service man from the Nutra Pewter Company, you know, makers of all the uh, computers here at your body control. Yeah. I have to make some uh, routine adjustments on the equipment. Uh. Oh, sorry, Mac. We're not supposed to let any strangers into body control while the Chief and B-1 are away. Uh, wait, wait a minute, Doctor. See, I ain't no, uh, no stranger, see? Here's my, uh, my, uh, my Nutra Pewter badge, see that? Well, I don't know. Uh, what do you think, Lois? Hmm. Well, he does have an identification badge, and, well, he seems like a nice enough fellow. And I heard the chief say just the other day that it was time to have the equipment adjusted. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't want anything to go wrong. Uh, well, what do you say, folks? Shall we open the door? Well, I... Well, I... Oh, I think it's okay. After all, Mr. Um, uh, uh, Pewterman, uh, Conrad uh, Pewterman. Uh, Mr. Pewterman isn't really a stranger if he works for the Nutra Pewter people. I'll open the Nutra part and let him in. Hey, that's pretty snazzy the way you do that there, huh? Yeah, I hope you don't mind my uh, popping in like this. Do uh, a little joke. Yeah, anyway, uh, you go ahead and, and relax, uh, you two. I'll, uh, I'll be through here in, uh, in just a jiffy, huh? No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's wrong? Well, uh, it's, uh, it's okay. I just have to make a couple of uh, adjustments. <sighs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. <gasps> Now what? It's a, it's a lucky thing I got here when I did there, lady. This uh, this equipment is uh, is uh, way out of line, you know. Yeah, it could have uh, it could have uh, blown up on you there. Yeah. Oh, and this uh, this tape is really uh, shot, you know. I'll uh, I'll just leave you a new one, right there. Well, uh, <clears throat> that's uh, that's about it for now. Oh, thank you. I'm so glad you got here in time. You know, the chief will be surprised when he sees the changes in his equipment. Yeah, he sure will, lady. Yeah, he sure will. Yeah. Well, uh, listen. Uh, can you can you pop me out of here now? Huh? Okay. Uh, just stand over by the Nutriport. Yeah. Over here, like this here. That's it. Yeah. Well, goodbye and thank y'all, Mr. Pewterman. Well, uh, you're all welcome to be sure. And, uh, and you can call me Con. <laughs> Con. <clears throat> what a nice man. I just hope the chief won't be mad that we let him in. Oh, don't be silly. Anyway, we just won't tell him until he sees how fine his instruments are tuned. Then he'll be pleased to know. Next morning, Chief Hardy and B-1 return from their emergency mission, and we hear... Chief! I still can't understand why Commissioner Welby would send us on an emergency call all the way to Washington when there was no problem there. Why, the gobbler and stuffing were nowhere to be found. 
Mayor Washi said he hadn't even called Commissioner Welby. It's hard to figure, B-1. Unless that wasn't the commissioner who called, but someone who was cleverly disguising his voice. Leap and larynx, Chief! You mean... What does Chief Hardy mean? Nothing went wrong while he and B-1 were away, or did it? Was that phone call part of Loeb's evil scheme? Do you think Ricky and Lois should have let Mr. Pewterman into body control? Don't miss the next exciting episode of The Adventures of Slim Goodbody in Nutra City!